you for joining us at Shopping with Peg. And Robin. Oh, wait. Hang on. Let's restart. Thank you for joining us at Shopping with Peg. And Robin. And we are here today with Ipsy. Ooh. And Limp Monthly. Ooh. I really have got to tell you, Ipsy is the most popular. It's been around the longest. It is also the least expensive, and a lot of women get it. Uh-huh. I started getting Limp Monthly. And they both have their benefits. I keep thinking I'm going to get rid of one, but I can't seem to decide. <laughs> Lip Monthly is actually $12.95. It's $10 plus $2.95. Shipping mm -hmm. by Ipsy is $10. Uh -huh. So anyway, let's go ahead and talk about Ipsy for a minute. Every month you get five trial size products. Some okay. of you get a full size product in a cosmetic bag. And it's, mm -hmm. every month is different. And this one says, and off she went to change the world. Uh-huh. Okay, and you open it up, and your uh, products are inside. Okay. Now, this time, there were some pretty good-sized uh, products in here. So, this one is uh, Ciate London Lip Luster Wildfire. Ooh, let's see if I get it to focus. It does not want to focus. So look at that color. Ooh. Isn't that color pretty? Yes. I, I really like that color. I'm wearing a different one from Lip Monthly. Um, I do like this color. I'm going to open it up real quick just to show you a little if I can. Mm -hmm. Actually, it smells pretty good, too. Ooh. Okay. Okay. So that's the first item I got. Now, the nice thing about Ipsy is you personalize your subscription to what you like. And because I'm not a big makeup person, I tend to get more uh, facial care, uh -huh. skincare stuff. Speaking of which, the next item is a coconut skin smoothie priming moisturizer. Uh huh. That looks interesting. It also smells very interesting. So, I'm going to open this a tiny bit. i going to show you a little bit about what it does. Let's see here. It's very thick. Mm -hmm. And then, I know it's for your face, but mm, smell it. Hmm, smells kind of like coconut and then those tropical sunscreens, you know? Yeah, but it's a much lighter scent than the tropical sunscreen. Oh, yeah. I think. A lot less. Here's the sunscreen chemicals. Yes. And it feels nice, and it already feels like it's dried on my hand. Mm -hmm. Is There's not any oily or sticky residue? Nope. I don't feel anything that's oily or sticky, which is nice to know. Nice. All right. The third item actually is... Hold on. It's not going to be this. I'm going to actually put this on. Well, it might be this. Hold on. Okay, so this third item, I'm actually rubbing it on you right now. Mm -hmm. Robin may want to open the package and show you what it looks like. It's in a little jar. Ooh, it is sparkly. Eliminating diamond peel-off mask. I can't tip it over too far because it's going to tip out. It is very, um, very, not super watery, but... It doesn't it smell bad. Of course, it's on top of the coconut stuff, so, <laughs> you know... It's by Disco Kitten, which I think she may have already shown you the box, yes. but in case she didn't. And I'm going to let that sit on my hand for a minute, and then I'll try to take it off. Okay. And see how it does as a peel-off mask. And it managed to stick to a couple of my fingers already. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the fourth item is Mani Mascara by Tarte. Mm -hmm. And if I remember correctly... Oh, this dried super fast. I'm already scrubbing it off my fingers. It says Voluptuous Mascara, so I think that means... It's supposed to add volume, but I'm not 100% sure. That sounds about right. She's chewing on your box, practically. <laughs> Isis, leave my box alone. Yeah, let's see if we get the bristles a bit better. So it's a small size one, but hey, it'll do. You know, mm -hmm. nice to get some mascara. And neither uh, of us really use mascara much, but at least it's there. It, right, and I do want to start using it. Um... I want to start doing some basics for makeup. I just haven't gotten around to it. Mm -hmm. I haven't got my stuff organized enough yet. 
And then the fifth item is Estate Do Me uh, Baked Highlight Powder in Pearl. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to go ahead and try to open this. Okay, I'm going to try to put this. Can you see it there? A little bit. T tilt your hand back and forth. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So, while we're doing that, I am working on peeling off this mask. Mm -hmm. So, it comes off. Pretty good. A little bit patchy, but not too bad. And since it's not that thick, it, it's not... Yeah, I didn't put it on very thick, which is why it's so patchy. Mm. So anyway, that's the, that is the mask. Still got some left. I'll get the rest <laughs> of it later. And then the pearl. So that was Ipsy for $10. You feel pleased with what you got? I'm very pleased with what I got. Um, what do you like most? I mean, what are you most excited about having? I don't know. I really like the smell on the coconut thing. Mm -hmm. This pearl is really pretty. If I could make myself start doing my, my <laughs> makeup, I'd really like it. Like the smell of this. Love the color of this. Now see, I wouldn't have figured you for using a shimmery highlighter. Um, yeah, I kind of... You'll try anything? You'll, uh, yeah. Broaden your horizons a bit. Exactly. Um, this one probably, I mean, I love masks. Uh -huh. So I know I'll use this one and I'll probably try and... I'll probably be very careful with it so I get more use, meaning I'll get ten half uses versus five really nice good uses, <laughs> knowing me. But I do like that. So anyway, that's the that's the $10 bag. Okay. Now, Lip Monthly just upped their game by going to a much nicer bag than they used to have. Okay. They used to be kind of fabric -y and honestly cheaply made. Okay. Okay. But with Lip Monthly, you get full-size products. Mm-hmm. Now, and it's all it's all lip products, right? It's all lip products. Okay. Okay. The one thing I like about it, ah, oh, I left one thing in the. Oh, come on here. The phone is attached properly now. Let's hope it doesn't fall off again. Um, and in the meantime, uh, mom is grabbing the last thing from the office that she forgot to put back in the pouch. So yay, back with you soon. Off the cute little zipper pull. Oh. And we're back! Yay! All right! Enough for technical difficulties. Okay, just to show you, once again, I was talking about the Lip Monthly bag. Mm -hmm. This was an example of an older Lip Monthly bag. Which is cute, but, you know, it's canvassy. It's holding all the cat hairs on it. Let's see again. So, versus this really nice little one. So, I really like the new bags better. Mm -hmm. Now I'm, I'm, Robin knows this already, I'm short one item and I just ran in to get it and I couldn't find it right off. Ah. Uh. So, here goes. Um, my very first item, which is a lipstick I am wearing, which I cannot believe, number one, I'm wearing lipstick. I normally <laughs> only wear lip gloss. Mm hmm Is Dirty Little Secrets Barely There. Mm-hmm. And so I'm going to open it up and show you. And then I'm going to have Robin smell it and tell me what she thinks it smells. It reminds her of. Isn't it cake batter or cupcake batter? Yeah, or? there's there's some vanilla in there. There's some stuff that's been... Uh, there's some sort of buttery egg kind of stuff. I'm telling you, this smells like I'm making cupcakes or something. Mmm, <laughs> I love this. Does it taste okay? Or at least oh, not I terrible? love it. <laughs> I love it. Okay. But I noticed even though you love it, it's still sticking to your lips. Yay! Yeah. In fact, the other day, we were at Walmart and Hart looked at me and went, you're wearing lipstick. <laughs> and I'm like, you can tell it. I was I was wearing this. He goes, yeah, you got a little bit on your on your teeth. <laughs> oh. <laughs> like, okay. So then the second thing we got was this. Um, no, that's that's the, the okay. Thing. Is and I haven't even tried it yet. I noticed that the uh, the plastic was still on it. Would you want me to open it up for you? Yes, please. Now, Robin and I were doing cosmetic resets. Actually, Robin Art and I were doing cosmetic resets. And we saw some of these different, um, by LA Colors, they had, um, uh, what did they call them? I think they were holographic, holographic locket look or something. Right. 
And I was like, oh, I really want to try it. But I didn't buy any. I was like, no, I'm going to wait till I lose some weight. And then the next day, my lip monthly came and it had this in it. I was like, oh, I got one anyway. So we shall. Okay, let me try. It's not really showing up very well. Let me see. Because it's, you know, it's mostly transparent clear, I think. Come on, focus. There we go. Can you see a difference at all? Not really. Anyway. It might need to go on thicker or something. I don't know. So anyway, that's that. It's a full-size product. <laughs> Oh, that's just pink sheen. I thought I could see a little bit of pink in there. From my lipstick. Yeah. Because it got it on the... I don't know if it actually got on there or not. Yeah. It did. <laughs> oh, dear. It's a mixed lipstick now. Works for me. Okay. The, the third item, I'll let Robin show you the box, is a crayon. I really like this color, too. Yeah, this would go with my dress. Kiss me. Mm-hmm. That is really cute. And then that's what it looks like. Nice. And then, okay, so that's one, two, three. The fifth item, which I don't have, was just a lip gloss, a little, um, I forget what the flavor was. It was really nice. I liked it. I just can't find it right now. And th so this was the la uh, last item. It's called Pierce Professional Smear Proof, and it's a lip liner. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm not too thrilled with them using the word gypsy, but the color does look nice. With them using what? The word gypsy. Oh. It's a slur. It's a pretty crayon. Or not crayon, pencil. And let me go ahead and put it on my... That's got some nice bold color. Very nice. Oof. I'll let you finish putting the lid back on. Thank you. I don't want to break something. So anyway, um, that's this bag. Mm -hmm. um, actually, let me go ahead and put these, since I'm going to have to wash my hands anyway. <laughs> I'll just rub them against your denim jeans. No! That's your denim. Um, I like the way they kind of sort of go together, mm -hmm. because I'll show you, this is the one I just put on that's on my lips. Mm -hmm. and and then, hold on a second. That's really subtle. So anyway. But overall, that's a cute color palette together. I really do like it. So let me refresh very quickly. Ipsy is $10. However, it is sample products. Five sample products. Mm -hmm. Okay. Lip Monthly is $12.95. But you get five full-size products if you don't lose one like I just did. Like I did. <laughs> We're doing this. Um, so I'm, you know, it really depends. What do you like? I don't wear a lot of makeup, so as I said, I do get skin care. There are makeup options with this, and I've got friends that get a lot of makeup. Um, you know, it just depends on what your what your settings are. Now, very quickly, I'll just quickly go over last month's lip monthly. I won't really open them up a lot or anything. Mm -hmm. I'll just show you a little bit. Last month, the color was actually a deeper color that they focused on. You had that. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Now, I'm not a lip, I am not a lipstick girl. Okay? Mm hmm And I put this one on last month, this one that's called Hot Chocolate. And I was like, wow, I really love this, only to find out it was a lipstick. And I was thinking it was a lip gloss. Mm hmm But it's really, really pretty. I'm actually going to do it on the outskirts of my hand here. Okay, that's the Hot Chocolate on the outskirts of my hand. Ooh, very nice. Um, okay, so we had that and that. We had a lip crayon last month. Mm -hmm. 
So it looks a lot like the same things you got this pack, just different colors. You're right, different color scheme. I got a toast lip liner. And vanilla peppermint, which Ooh. actually has some oh, color on it. Oh, that smells good. I should give it to you if you want it. Pink eye, tinted balm, pink piece, vanilla peppermint. Nom, 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 nom. Let me see what it's like color-wise. Okay, It's nice. just a really light tint. Let's sort of up, down, down. Okay, nice. So, uh, yeah, if you want it, it's yours. <laughs> anyway, so that's it. Uh, the difference between them. Which would I recommend? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> If you really like lip products, and basically the only thing I do if I put on makeup 99% of the time is lip gloss, maybe mascara. Yeah, for me it's, it's pretty much lip balm. It's the easiest, less ha least hassle thing to put on. Right. So for that reason, I really like Lip Monthly. It's it's actually getting me out of my comfort zone a little. <laughs> I, before, I never would have touched lipstick, and I wouldn't have even used this had I read it was lipstick. I was thinking <laughs> it was lip gloss, and I put it on, and I'm like... That's heavier than I'm thinking it is. And I go reading it, and turns out it's a matte lipstick. And I'm like, I didn't know lipsticks came like this. <laughs> so, um, because I just, I'm always uncomfortable using these. I don't know why. Mm. So anyway, that's Lip Monthly and Ipsy. Um, I would say get what you like. Try them both. Um, I will live, I will try to leave links below. I don't know if I get anything or you get anything. I don't remember, to be honest with you. But I will leave, leave links below for both of them. And if there's anything special about the links, we'll be sure to put that in the description, too. We will? Okay. <laughs> you, you will. I'm volunteering you to do this. So, anyway, that's uh, Lip Monthly versus Ipsy. Um, I have gotten others before. These are the only two I'm staying with. And I keep trying to tell myself I'm going to drop one of them. And I just never can decide. Mm. I do like the fact about Ipsy, I can put it on hold for a month. Mm. really do like that. I've done that before. So anyway, that's, uh, I'll just show you my colors here. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great day. Um, and I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something from Thank it. Thank you for watching. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.